President Moon Jae-in arrived in Laos today, the last leg of his three-nation tour to ASEAN nations. During summit talks with his Laotian counterpart, the two agreed on some concrete steps to ensure mutual prosperity and enhance cooperation between Korea and the Mekong region. Her Park Jun has the details on the summit. President Moon Jae-in held talks with his Laotian counterpart, Bun Hyang Vorchith, on Thursday to discuss concrete ways to advance their bilateral relations. During their summit in Vientiane on Thursday, the two leaders agreed to join hands and create a community where both countries can mutually grow. This will be done by developing agricultural communities and improving Laos's economy as well as its people's lives through infrastructure projects along the Mekong River. Korea and Laos will also enhance their partnership with numerous MOUs. Korea will provide funding of 500 million U.S. dollars to Laos through the Economic Development Cooperation Fund between 2020 and 2023. Seoul and Vientiane will also step up exchanges in farming technology, ICT and startups. Citing the country's abundant resources and its great potential for growth as the battery of Asia, President Moon highlighted the unlimited potential the country has for economic advancement. Riding on such potential, the South Korean president is optimistic that the two countries can achieve mutual growth combining Korea's new southern policy and Laos's development strategy. And President Vorchev praised President Moon's ongoing efforts to achieve complete denuclearization and lasting peace on the Korean Peninsula. Moon thanked Laos for its consistent support in its peace roadmap for the Korean Peninsula. The two countries will also work to strengthen ties between Korea and ASEAN, as well as between Korea and the wider Mekong Delta region. This will happen while they continue to cooperate closely on the upcoming South Korea ASEAN Special Summit and South Korea Mekong Summit hosted by Korea this November. This trip to Laos completes President Moon's ASEAN diplomacy. His visit to seven ASEAN nations has secured more than 130 projects ranging from agriculture to fourth industrial revolution technology. The Blue House says it will work to accelerate those projects to make concrete results. Park Kijun, Aida News, Vientiane.